Hi everyone, my name is Jin Zheng Yang, metric number 145208. The topic will be Persona, Collapse. Persona is made to be broken. I got my medical report on the other day and it said I had a fatty liver and a mild obesity, which reinforced the fact that I think I'm a fat person and my friends think I'm a fat person now too. I'm a person who suffered from a persona and has been living under the, the restrictions of the persona I have given myself for almost the last few years and it has been very painful. Everyone has their own persona and our day-to-day -day life is often limited by these personas. Wouldn't you like to know what we would be like without those limitations of those uh, so-called personas? To get a better life, we must be good at breaking down those boring and uh, useless personas, such as uh, term in terms of per appearances, ages, and occupations. Whatever the persona, doctor, policeman, teacher, the easiest thing to be broken is persona in terms of appearance and size. The worst thing is not being fat or thin, but this fat or thin persona, rather, it is that you please other but hate yourself. Our appearances is always easily judged by our outside world, and it was only after I became fat that I realized that the world is not very friendly to fat people. Some people will even say to you, "You are so fat. Teach me how to gain weight." And don't, uh, don't all girls think that they are fat? Even a girl in front of me, she was already thin and uh, kind of sickly. Breaking the persona of your body is not about making you lose weight or gain weight. Rather than it is for you not to change your opinion of yourself because what others think. And it is not just body appearances. Age is also an important factor in our persona. Breaking the persona of the age is to tell you, don't do something because of your age. Who exactly set people up like that? What age is set and what things are to be done? F such as freedom-loving Americans have the core value in their life called agelessness. It means that treating your age as if it doesn't exist. Not having the sense of how old am I in this year and not letting your age become a limitation or an excuse. Do not know when age also become an important label and personal. I know I'm going to uh, primary school at 6, middle school at 12, high school at 15, and the university at 18. But do I have to get married at 25, have a children at 30, have a successful career at, at 35, Breaking the persona of age is to tell you, don't do something because of your age, but more importantly, don't let your age stop you from doing something. Don't define yourself because of your appearance, body shape, age, or even your career, occupation. Let your career be your enabler, not your shaker. I collect information from my Chinese friend and uh, concluded that both teachers and students who came from public universities are labeled as good students and hardworking teachers. And over the time, the teachers and the students themselves build up a personal for themselves. Such as uh, personal experiences, uh, when I express that I came from a public university, people would like to uh, look me differently and think I was great. But when I said I came from a private university, people would only think I was rich. Regardless of any professions, occupations, and career, when I spend the time uh, with others outside of work, myself or others will carry my personal with me. Such as police officers still have the, the power to enforce the law after hours. Doctors still have the obligation to respond to emergency issues after work. So we should take off those masks of our professions and occupations and live the life we want to live. Follow our passions and live with our own attitude and temperature. 
To get the better life, as I mentioned before, we must be good at breaking down those boring and useless personas and so-called personas, such as in terms of appearance, age, and occupation. One way to break down the persona is to always ask yourself, who do you want to be in the way do you want to be remembered? If these questions are not enough to give you the motivation to break a persona, just think, if you were to leave this world one day, what words would you be written on your antipath? I don't think it would be this man lived to be 80 years old and uh, he was just a working man. That's all for today. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.